just to see the smiles on my kid's face, it means the world to me. You know, Kamarian, he's, he's a God's blessing, he's an angel. This little boy will crack you up. You know, he had the little cute little dimples, you know. He was just a, a beautiful little boy. He was never sick. I worked two part-time jobs and plus take care of the kids. It's just how life is, you know. We make it. You know, it's hard, but we make it. Mario was diagnosed with a ALL, leukemia. I hate saying the words. I hate hearing the words. For somebody to tell you that your grandchild that you took care of since he was four months old has cancer, you know, when you hear the word cancer, it's just one of the worst things that goes through your mind. Is he gonna die? Is he gonna be all right? What's gonna happen? And my baby kept saying he was scared. Grandpa, I'm scared. You know, seeing him so sick and all them tubes in his arms. Kids shouldn't have to worry. They should be able to go run around, have fun, play, and just be a normal child. I think that's one of the great things about the village is we do exactly that for them for the week that they're here. I see so many times that kids that their wish is to come to go to Disney or go to Universal or go to SeaWorld. We make it happen for them. A lot of the families have never been on vacation due to the challenges of having a child with a life-threatening or terminal condition. It's now that these families need that time together. They need a break from their doctor visits and hospital stays and treatments. It's not something that can wait. Magic happens here every day. Give Kids the World is one of the only organizations that provides not only for the WISH child, but for the whole WISH family. They are here for probably the best week of their life. It's given them a renewed strength to fight. You know, there's nothing that beats it. There are a lot of families who say that this place has changed their life and changed their child's life and that are still here because of the village. Just the fun that is here. The kids having fun, they don't think about their sickness. And that's what they need sometimes to get it off their mind. That's part of healing. This village is not filled with sadness. This village is filled with hope and smiles. Kids eating ice cream, kids riding rides, kids being kids. This is something I would never be able to afford to give them myself. And that's why I'm thankful for coming here because I've never seen him this happy since his sickness.